Arab Tov, I'm Stephen Benoon, and you are watching Israeli News Live. At 8 p.m. this evening, only moments ago here in Israel, marked the beginning of Holocaust Memorial Day. It's been 70 years since World War II ended, and not far from where I'm at now here in Jerusalem, Prime Minister Benjamin Netanyahu will be speaking live, and of course you can catch it on Israel National News. If, you're, if you catch our news broadcast in time, you can actually listen to him give the the speech there at Yad Vashem, where they are remembering the Holocaust victims. And my wife and I took a trip ourselves. We went all through Europe. In fact, my wife, most of her family still lives in Europe. And we went to quite a few of the concentration camps, including this past week, we were in Germany, in Munich, at Dokau. I want to share some of those images with you there that we saw there. In fact, it's the one place where they allowed us to actually film the crematoriums. But even in Auschwitz in Poland and other in Austria. We were at another concentration camp there and, and as well as in Slovakia. Seeing the evil and the horrors that the people, the Jewish people, not just Jewish people, but other people that the Germans didn't like, but especially the Jewish people, six million of them sent to their deaths. In my own family, my wife's family as well, we both lost family members to this tragic event. So it's a very difficult time for us as well as we, as we remember. My father's family, my mother's family, many of them died in this Holocaust. So as we remember the loved ones that we've lost and as other Jewish families have lost, and especially those wonderful Christians that at the peril of their own lives tried to save the Jewish people and also lost their lives, let us take this day and remember them as well. I'm Stephen Benoon with Israeli News Live.